Okay, hopefully that's a good thumbnail. So, so in today's video, we're going to be discussing my Sol Janeiro, that's how you say it, yeah, Sol Janeiro, Sol de Janeiro body creams. So I got all these from Sephora. They were $22 because I got the smaller ones. They have larger ones. I think they're eight ounces for $44 or $48 or something like that. Yeah, I'll put the price, the correct price right there. So first we're going to get into the original, which is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. And this one, they all have like this cute little tab thing. We like that. Although it sometimes can be a pain when I have nails. So I just dropped this. That's why it looks like this. So this is what it looks like. Yeah, so the large size, which is the 8.1 ounces, is $48. And now they have a refill for the larger size, which is $46. Then you have this size, which is the mini size, which is 2.5 ounces. And this is $22. So I'm actually happy that I bought the mini size because I don't know if you can see. I I'm only have like this much left and they come like up to here or something. I'm glad I bought the mini size first because now if I get the larger size, well, I'm getting a larger size. Now when I get the larger size, when I finish this, I can actually refill this because this fits easy in my bag. I like buying like mini jars of things because I can just refill them with the big jar, which is cool, which is what I want. So on Sephora's website, it says this is a fast absorbing body cream with an addictive scent and visibly tightening smoothing formula that adds a hint of shimmer to the skin. I've never seen a hint of shimmer to my skin <laughs> when I wear this. Maybe it's like very, very slight. Like I don't run out of space now. Like when they say shimmer, they mean like those little shiny reflective dot reflect. Yeah, I don't see anything reflective, any shimmer. Maybe it's just because it's like if it mean like that lotion shine, I see that lotion shine. But I don't think that's a shimmer. I think that's just because I have one lotion or body cream or something like that. So they say that it's a warm, sweet gourmand scent. It's vanilla, salted caramel and pistachio. Definitely smell the vanilla. Well, I smell everything, actually. I just didn't know what nut it was, but now that I know, I definitely got the, the vanilla and the caramel come right off. You just don't know which kind of nutty scent it is. I couldn't tell it was, but that's true. So the ingredients, the highlighted ingredients are guarana, which helps visibly smooth and tighten the appearance of skin. Capuceyu butter, full of fatty acids. Phy phytosterol. Okay, yeah. So this is supposed to tighten it from you. So this is supposed to tighten it from your skin. To be honest with you, I don't know if it does that. I put it all over my body. I don't feel like I'm necessarily loose. So I don't think, I don't know if it's working. The smell is amazing and it lasts for a really long time. The Sol de Janeiro fragrance smells different than this. And if you put them on together, sometimes the lotion can be more overpowering. Or you can lose the scent of the perfume in the scent of the lotion. Be mindful. I love this smell though. On its own, I love the smell. I don't like I, I don't care if it if it makes my skin tighter or not. The smell is worth it. It's worth the 22 or the 48. And it's a really, really good cream. It lasts for a long time. Their formulations are really, really good. Not gonna lie. Then the next one I got is the Balm Dia Bright Cream. Yeah, I don't know what this does. Retexturizing body cream nourishes as it reveals healthier, smoother, brighter looking skin. Yet again, not gonna lie, have no clue. Like not even, I need guys to stop emailing me trying to take me on dates or vacations. It's a little weird. This cream has vitamin C. This one doesn't come with a refill for the larger size. And the larger size is 48. The small size is 22. Okay, I didn't drop this one. <laughs> this one has such a... This smell reminds me of something and I just can't put my finger on it. So this is a warm floral scent with black amber plum, vanilla woods, and jasmine bloom. That black amber plum is like... It makes it like a little deeper scent. Like, 
it is it does give you like a light floral okay it reminds okay it's not up there i don't know where it is oh great somebody got me it reminds me of noir 23 or 29 by le labo i talked about it in my vanilla video yeah it reminds me like a softer warmer version of the noir like noir is powerful this is like noir I, I don't want to say muddled down but it's like noir muddled down with vanilla so it's like a more it's like a less standoffish scent and more of a new not neutral but it's just a toned down version of noir with like vanilla smells really really good i should pair these two together i wonder if i have subconsciously and not even realized it hmm. So it says it makes your skin softer, smoother, and visibly brighter. I I don't know. I I I yeah, I don't know. I guess I have to start looking at my butt. I lotion my butt really well. Did I just scratch myself? Yep, yep, sure did. This smells so good. Again, worth the smell. The smell. Their formulations are so soothing to the skin and their scents are so strong on their own without without these are something you could wear especially in the summertime winter time anytime with nothing on no fragrance and you still smell like something and it's crazy i got into my uber let's get into the last one this is the beja floor elasti cream right quick story time i got into my uber and all i had was this on and she was just like you smell divine and i was like huh and i was like I'll insert the clip. Is that I like really purchased these these lotions like on a whim. Like I had no indication that like they was gonna smell good. They was gonna smell good. That just mean you got that eye. That's your talent, right there. And yeah, I was just like, you know what? Let's try this. Fuck it. I need some new lotions. Cause I usually use um well, I usually use everything, but I have like a like a big lotion collection now. And funny that you said that you could smell it because <laughs> i was literally lotioning and then i was like i smell amazing and i was like let me go but i don't think other people can smell my lotion like my fragrance but not my lotion because oh, no, I, I didn't think that she could smell just my lotion on me like i'm fully dressed it was cold she said you smell divine and i showed her what it was and she was like for real i was like yeah this is it. It's just lotion. Why is there a piece of hair right there? What? Like, it just melts into the skin, y'all. So, this is the one that they associate with Baccarat. This Beja is like the Baccarat dupe, I guess. It does smell like Baccarat. The fact that when I'm not wearing this or not paying attention, I'm like, did I? What did I put on today? I haven't worn my Baccarat in almost a year. I'm tired of everybody smelling like it this smells like it so much and subconsciously i think that i reach for it for that reason without even realizing that i'm reaching for it this smells really 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 good it smells similar to baccarat okay i got it. you know what i'm ready to just wipe my makeup off with you guys because this is crazy i keep touching my face so they have a big big version of this that's 85 dollars, and it comes with like Oh, it was limited edition. It's out of stock. Oh, oh it says available in store only. It comes with like a little surfboard. I'll insert a picture. It comes with like a little surfboard, and I kind of want it just to get the surfboard so I can use it for all my lotions. Like, I want something that's like a shoehorn that I could just dip into my lotions and put it on my body and then rub it in. I don't want to use my fingers. So, this has a lushy fruit. This has a lush, fruity, floral fragrance. The signature fruity floral fragrance is infused with notes of Brazilian jasmine, pink dragon fruit. I keep saying this, pink dragon fruit, dragon, dragon. Pink dragon fruit has no smell to me. It barely has a taste. Yellow dragon fruit, super sweet. It reminds me of sugar cane. It reminds me of chewing on sugar cane, 100%. But I, I just don't understand because... Pink dragon fruit has no fragrance to me. Or do they mean pink dragon fruit where the dragon fruit is pink? Or when the outside is pink? I, I, I don't remember. And it says this, this had 
this has plant-based collagen and like some women like use it it says recommended use uh for this i forgot what it's called degligé or decolette whatever they use it this clinical study was like twice a week for eight weeks twice a day for eight weeks <gasps> to like help like bring back the elasticity elasticity to their uh skin right here where it's like crumpy and starts to wrinkle and hang maybe i should start using this on that area because i feel like i'm getting like a little <laughs> tighten up bitch tighten up So overall, I definitely love their product. I love their fragrances. I don't have any of the sprays. I am not a big fan of body sprays or perfume mists. I just, I feel like they're cheap. <laughs> I feel like they're cheap. And I don't know why I think that. I think it's because I, I associate with them with like Victoria's Secret, like high school. So maybe that's why. They do have a new Rio Radiance Illuminating Body Cream. It's limited edition. I want to get the little one and the big one. So it says that it has beachy notes of solar tuberose and lete de coco capture the nostalgic scent of sunshine on skin and warm sand for carefree vacation vibes. This smells, first of all, I love tuberose. That's like such a, first of all, I love tuberose. And then the cocoa, I feel like it's going to give me like warm vanilla. I feel like it's going to give me what St. Bart's gives me, but maybe like a little better. I don't know because it's tuberose and it's not like something else. Oh, I don't know. But it's not too late for me to go to Sephora, actually. I don't need to spend any money. Yeah, so it says it has carrot seed oil too. And ethyl resorts mica. I don't even know what that is. But that's one scent that I don't have from them that I do want to try or one lotion. Yeah, all their other lotions I have. Oh, and I want to try the Coco Cabana Cream. The Coco Cabana Intense Hydration Body Cream. I want to try that one. It's out of stock right now on Sephora. Maybe I could find it in store. I'm not sure. And it smells like coconut cream, tropical orchard, and toasted praline. I really love that. Oh, yes. I got to get those two. So thank you guys for watching. I'm probably about to get up right now and go to uh, Sephora. Yeah. Toodles.